What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I am back with another Fortnite news video and today we have some strange, epic and weird things to cover. Uh, but before we go any further people, as always I am giving away 2800 V-Bucks on that weekly basis. To enter simply make sure you are subbed to this channel, hit that bell button to turn notifications on, drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. Winners are contacted via direct message on YouTube so keep an eye on those in boxes good luck everybody also people excuse my voice i have come down with a man flu as we all know man flu is way worse than women flu and it's killing me my nose is blocked my throat is sore my eyes are watery all sorts but it ain't stopping me bringing you daily videos so let's get into it and first up we are going to cover one hilarious bug which believe it or not is not intended which a lot of people think it might be you guys know of the St. Patrick's Day costume. Well, for some folks, it turns them into leprechauns. Yes, you heard that right. This was first spotted by the face of Fortnite Ninja. See and view this video on the screen now. Credit to Ninja, whose Twitch and YouTube channel can be found linked within the video description. We see what looks to be an actual leprechaun. Now, upon first glance, you think it could just be one of them weird uh, camera angles. But upon slowing it down and zooming in, we can clearly see this is one short ass player. Now Fortnite have confirmed this is a bug and we'll see that in a sec, but guys, what are the odds here? The bug to turn you into a dwarf comes with a St. Patrick's Day leprechaun suit. I mean, you couldn't make this stuff up, you really couldn't. Here is what Fortnite PR Nick Chester said about this bug. I checked, definitely not intentional. I passed it along to the team. Hilarious timing for this bug to appear. Seriously so funny, for a second I thought it was intentional and I just missed it. I mean they fixed a rainbow into the map yesterday for the weekend out of the blue so... So yeah guys, as funny as this is and how good the timing is, I doubt this was intentional. I mean it would give a player a proper unfair advantage. Especially if you're running around half the size of everybody else. Plus epic are certain of the fact cosmetic items in the game are just that, cosmetic and offer no advantages over other players. They are looking into this bug and addressing it. So tell me guys, have you seen any leprechauns? Let me know down below. Next up, the face of Fortnite Ninja growing every single day. Drake on his stream, interviewed by TV shows. The dude is getting bigger and bigger every single day. With this and becoming the biggest game in the world right now, many assumptions come out about how much this guy earns. Well, he's thought to be earning over 500 grand per month. His YouTube channel with 5 million subs gets over 150 million views a month. A Twitch subscriber fan base of over 200,000. Let me tell you guys, this dude earns way more than that. And you know what? He deserves it. He has been in the game now for 10 plus years. His time is now. All that hard work has paid off. Plus the dude is a super nice guy and real genuine and down to earth. So fair play to him. I am so fed up of seeing dudes get big and they're up their own asses. It's about time a proper dude like Ninja finally makes it. But 500k a month, this guy earns way more than that, trust me. He gets at least half of his Twitch $5 per month sub revenue per sub. I have been told this can go up to 80%, so you work that out. There are also sub tiers, and did you guys forget about his donations, plus his sponsors? And that's even without talking about his YouTube revenue. This dude is minted, and again, fair play to him. He deserves it for sure. Okay, so we're going to move on and Blitz is this week's limited time game mode and damn, it is crazy. It reminds me of Fortnite's version of Mayhem. By the time you have landed, the storm is already on your ass and it is relentless for sure. Now, when it first dropped, it was only available to play in teams, meaning if you wanted to go solo, you could, but it would be extra hard because you were put in against teams of four. Epic last night added the inclusion of a solo Blitz mode. Now I know many solo players wanted this but didn't think it was ever coming. Well it's live now for you guys to play. I ain't tried it yet myself but definitely will be trying it later. Okay so lastly I'm going to cover a glitch which I posted last night and it's to carry unlimited items. So basically you have an unlimited inventory space. Now I won't go through the basics of how this glitch is done. If you want to check it out the video is on my channel like I said. But the thing I do want to talk about is the boogie bomb, the item behind the glitch which was removed from the game so they could fix this glitch of sort. I thought it was this glitch they were talking about, but it seems as though it ain't. I was doing it last night within the Blitz game mode. I don't know if it works in normal, because I ain't sure if the loot pool there is the same as well it is in Blitz, and the Booger one is still a part of that, but it definitely works within that Blitz game mode. And like I said, you can find that video linked on my channel. This glitch, it can be game breaking if used right, and I'm pretty sure once Epic do clock on, they will fix it for good. 
but we will see people we will see on that note guys we have come to the end of the video thanks as always for stopping by i do appreciate that support remember to win some juicy v books subscribe to the channel if you're new around here hit that bell button to turn on notifications leave a like on the video and drop a comment down below but guys thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully people i will see you on that next one